Okay, so I've seen a lot of things on the forums lately about people wondering how to hook up three jaw chucks to their rotary tables. And there's a million ways to do it, but I thought I'd make a quick video and show you how I do it. Basically what I have is my my old three jaw lathe chuck. I made a mounting plate for it. Use countersunk bolts to mount the chuck to the plate and there's a hole right through it. And then made this arbor which is a uh, Morse taper 3 to a straight shank and in the end of it I have a center hole center drilled made this as precise as I could on my lathe turned it real carefully so the way I mount mine is I have T-bolts, T-nuts put the T-nuts in the slots I'm only going to put two in for this demo take the chuck Clean it off. Put it up on the, on the thing there. Start a couple bolts. Okay, and what you do is uh, take this arbor. <laughs> Stick it down into the tapered hole and then loosely snug up the chuck on the, on the arbor. That centers everything up. And you can just tighten up the T-bolts. This is an 8 inch rotary table with a 6 inch chuck on it. It was the old chuck to my lathe before I got my 6 jaw. Okay, so now we know the chuck is centered on the rotary table. <clears throat> if you're careful about how you make this arbor, it gets pretty damn close. Definitely within the limits of my three jaw chuck. Okay, and, and what I do is um, the rotary table is loose on the machine. Uh, so what I do is I mount a ground center in my spindle, line it up pretty close by eye and once you get that thing in the hole, just push it down and she'll line right up. Okay. And you can just pull the, tighten up the clamps for the table. And there you go. Take the arbor out. Now 
And you are ready to rock. Yep, and that's how, that's how I do it. I'm sure there are a lot of different ways, but it works good for me. And all I did to make this thing is I took one of these Phase 2 um, sleeves. I think this was an MT1 to an MT3. And um, bored it out on the lathe. And um, turned this bar out of stainless. Pressed it in. I put, I think, about a three thousandths press fit on this. I also turned the end up here so this would fit into a half inch collet. This uh, also comes in handy if you mount the rotary table sideways. You want to line it up with the with the tailstock for the rotary table. Put a dead center in that, and um, you know, just line it up with that uh, center hole. Okay. Hope that helped you. Bye.